Hey guys, we're going to continue our numerical methods uh, in MATLAB today with the uh, composite trapezoidal method. Um, this one's a little more complicated than the rectangular method, uh, but might not see bad. Uh, we're using the same X matrix, 0 to 30 in increments of 2, same R matrix, which corresponds to each value in the, the X, and then our H, which is the step size, in this case it's 2 again, N, which is the length of the X matrix. Uh, so we have a new variable here, it's the the S trap. Oops. And uh so this is what this is right here. This this right this the for loop is only doing this middle uh value here. So here is F of A, which is R of one, and F of B, which is R of N, B being the ten point six, and R of one being the fifteen here. Now the confusing part may be the S trap. Now what this is doing, it's taking from i of 2, adding 2 times r of 2, so it, it, initially this is 0 for the first step, and then it's, so this, it's going it's to take 0, this is 0, plus r of i times 2, so it's this times 2. Now it's going to sum that, it's going to keep doing that all the way to 9.6. So for uh, r of 3, it's going to take the sum of this last one, plus 2 times 11.9, as you can see here. Now, <coughs> similar to the rectangular method, this actually means i of i equals 2 to n minus 1. Uh, if you don't know why, there are several videos. Uh, Patrick JMT probably does one, or Khan Academy. But it uh, it's just the calculus behind it, if you do not remember it. There, there are videos that explain that. And this once again the f of b will be the f basically f of n which is the 10.6 in this case so here we have the i so we have h over 2 times f of a here i'll get this back out times f of a times the sum value which is this it's just the simplified form of it and then f of b which is the r of n in this case now when you run this as you can see it's it is different from the previous rectangular method um and we're going to do a comparison once I get to the 3 8th video, and I'll show you the long uh, script for that that just does all of them at the same time. Uh, so I'll see you in the next video.